Hi guys, Asha from Mobile Geeks here. It's day zero of Computex 2013 in Taipei. So it's kind of starting to build up some momentum over here. You know this device. That's the Is Iconia W510. It's the very first um, Intel Atom 10.1 inch Windows 8 tablet from Acer. There have been quite some rumors uh, recently about a smaller Windows 8 tablet form factor and guess what we have? That's exactly what we are playing around with for the last 30 minutes or so. That's the new Acer Iconia W3, the very first 8.1 inch Windows 8 tablet. It's based on the Intel Atom Clover Trail platform. That means it's a Z2760, 1.8 gigahertz dual core comes with hyper threading. It comes with two gigabytes of RAM and there are versions with 32 and 64 gigabyte SSD for the pricing. Uh, in Europe, it will be priced at uh, 329 euros for the 32 gigabyte version and 379 for the 64 gigabyte version. Um, the resolution of the display is 1280 by 800 is a five touch points uh, capacitive multi-touch screen. Let's quickly walk around the device. So we have a power button here, micro USB and HDMI out. It's nothing on the bottom. Uh, on the right side we have a connector for your headset and for your PSU. And on the top we have a micro SD card slot and a volume rocker. Well, it's not a rocker, it's a single volume buttons. The two megapixel camera on the back and there is a 2 megapixel camera on the front, of course. The typical Windows 8 button takes you to the modern UI. Um, performance is really nice. Uh, we couldn't see any lags at all, even though, of course, we can't run a benchmark over here right now. Um, but just trust me, I think the Windows experience was at like uh, 3.1, which is something that we would expect from a Clover Trail uh, platform. So it's basically on the same performance level as, as the Acer Iconia W510. What's really interesting about it is, uh, in terms of accessories, they're going to have a docking station with a keyboard. See a beautiful chiclet keyboard, huge left and right um, shift keys, which I really like, and with a couple of status LEDs here for Bluetooth and for power. And on the back, there's even a little power button here, but I just can't tell you if the final version will look like this. So you would just put it here in this little slot, and then if you want to do some emails or whatnot, you know what, you can just use this keyboard on the back, which kind of looks a little bit like um, a docking bay, and that's exactly what it is. Let's just try that here, and here we go. So you can easily carry your Iconia W3 together with this keyboard. You know what? It holds. Just you know, just as a as a safety backup, right? <laughs> you never know, right? But uh, I think it's a, it's a beautiful combination. Before I'm just getting this out, uh, we have another device over here um, to give you an idea about the size differences. W510, W3. That's definitely a really mobile tablet. By the way, weight 540 grams. So it's going to be available, I guess, in June, as far as I know. So I can't wait to finally um, get the final device uh, of the Acer Iconia W3 so we can run it through all the benchmark. And of course, it's going to be interesting to see how a very mobile and compact Windows 8 tablet is going to perform. That's the new Acer Iconia W3. I'm Sasha from Mobile Geeks. Thanks for watching.